Hello, it's Gem Games, and in this quick video, I'm gonna show you how to fix the rotation of some animation that you might have created or imported or something like that. So, as you can see, this animation is rotated, rotated to the left in my from my perspective, and these others are facing the camera, like, like that. This is basically the zero rotation. So, we want to fix that. How we can do that? We want to click that animation and we want to go to skeleton tree. We want to click the root and now we have all these transforms here. We want to set this set transform. If it's uh, if your animation is facing right uh, from your character's perspective, then you want to minus from it. So I have 90 degrees here. I will set it to zero like that. And how you can save this, you want to add a key. Okay. And if you just leave it like this, it will work. But some, in some cases with like any montages and stuff like that, it will not work correctly. So what you want to do, you want to go to the create asset and create animation, current animation and preview mesh. Then you want to select your, fo your folder. For example, I will import this to the third blueprints. Let's call it mm ball loop fixed okay let's import it or create it okay as you can see now we have this old one with the keys and the new one here at the bottom without the keys and it's the rotation is fixed so that's one way but other way is i will show you i will go to the first normal mm for loop and i will delete these keyframes and as you can see now it's facing to the left so it's incorrect again other way is if you just delete this file and you import your animation again, if you have them on your uh, folder, you select, of course, your skeleton. And here on the import rotation, you can add some rotations to it. So in my case, I want to add minus 90 degrees. So if you're, like I told you before, if it's facing originally too much to the right, then you want to minus from it. If it's facing to the left, then you want to add to it, like positive 90. Okay, but I will add minus 90, so negative. So let's import. As you can see, the animation is facing correctly again. But one thing to notice, when you import those files again, if I delete this, I will show you. Uh, I want to import later on some other files. When you are importing them, this import rotation will be there always. So your other animations might be rotated incorrectly uh, after that. So you want to... Next time, check if you want to set this to back zero, like if you are using some other animations that are facing correctly, you know. So yeah, I think that was all for this video. If you like what you saw, please click the like button and subscribe for more. And yeah, hope you have a great day and see you on the next one.